All right, I'm gonna hit record and try to remember what the fuck we were doing. Oh, right, we had just finished rebuilding the town. That's right, we had, we had just finished rebuilding the town. I remember now. Uh, which is pretty bitchin', actually. All right, you know what we need to do? Um... I need to figure out how to get into this thing. Because there's obviously a shrine nearby. Oh, I bet I can't do it because it's raining. Here comes the pants grab. Pants grab. Thank you. You like the lawnmower that I had going? I did too. All right, we're going to go to Terrytown for a hot minute. Because uh, I need to do some shenaniganery. We need to do a bit of shenaniganry. Uh, specifically, we need to start uh, deinstalling some of the co combination stuff that we've stolen from shrines. Uh, because at the moment, we can't use a lot of our weapons because they're currently like locked behind shrine bullshit. So I would like to unlock those things from shrine bullshit. Given the option. Here comes the manager. When you want to post the most base copy pasta on the TTS but don't want to mess up the recording, right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know, I've ruined all of your fun, chat. I guess I don't have any jizz balls right now. Good to know. Okay. Son and done. Break apart shop. Okay, so he disassembles weapons. Uh, okay, break it down. I would like to disassemble. Uh, well, this for one. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Start before you can say sun and break it down. Zipsa before you say sun. Ba bum, ba dum bum. Zipsa. Yeah. Broke down. No prop. It's in the collection area. So don't forget to go grab it. Okay. Okay. Now I need to break this one down. Okay. Hold on. Can I pick this up? Not as it is. Okay. Batteries needed? Nah. Welcome back, Skyward. Okay. Now we disassemble this one. Yeah. So the reason that I'm doing this is because a lot of these things are shrine stolen, which means that we took them from shrines. You ate the last of the bat. God damn it. But I would like to have these for later construction usage. So we need to move them for now. So we're gonna we're gonna do a little bit of um, disassembling these guys so that we can have the the parts from the shrines. You brought me to bed with you? Hell yeah. A lot of people seem to like following to sleep. Fall, falling to sleep with my voice. So you're in good company. Alright, what am I gonna build with them? Nothing at the moment. Nothing at the moment. Um. But... Okay, that's fine. Uh, so this thing, we can now go to the auto builder and we can save it as a favorite. And now that it's saved as a favorite, we have a uh, permanent way to get them back. 
And I guess we don't really need this anymore. Since it turns out it's not... It's been fixed. Since it turns out that bug's been fixed. Oh, and I think we... Do we need this one anymore? No, this was the busted version. So we can get rid of that too. So we can get rid of that. Dream stream fully awake and feel late on you pass out in like five minutes tops. Yeah. People seem to like the sound of my voice. Okay, do I have a picture of these guys? I don't think so. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so now that we've got that set. Um... I guess we should head back here and, and let them know. Now that that's done. You don't normally go to sleep until 2.30, so you've got a little bit of time since it's only 11.38. That's fair. That's fair. I, I generally stream until about 4 a.m. Eastern time. Um, so yeah. Feel free to enjoy the sound of my voice. You might get into a little trouble for this, but worth it. Oh, no. Should I be afraid? Should I be afeard? Should I be terrified? One inch long, 12 inches wide. They call me the slam. <laughs> Fair. Hmm. I'm worried sick about everyone in Laurelin Village. Hey. Maybe I should head back there and scope out the situation. Mm -hmm. Don't be ridiculous. Whoa. The pirates are really dangerous. Losing my hometown was enough, but losing you too? Not an option. Whoa. Uh, a customer. Sorry about that. We were caught up in a conversation. Actually, I killed everything there, so, you know, we're Whoa. good now. The pirates are already gone. And Rosal and everyone from the village are okay too? Whoa. Thank goodness. I'm so glad. They're all safe. I was beside myself. Uh. To top it off, the ruined buildings have all been restored. Thank you for bringing us the best possible news. Please have this as a sign of our gratitude. <gasps> Yo, mighty salt grilled crab. Grants a mid-level attack power boost. Nine out of ten fishermen agree crab is best enjoyed grilled and with just a bit of salt. Oh. Your friends get mad since only four and a half hours of sleep. Eh, sleep is for the weak. Mighty salt grilled... That mighty salt grilled crab is my finest cooking. It's a dish that really brings out the warrior in you. Please enjoy. The pirate's gone and the village back to normal. I have to wonder how our little shop back home is looking. And as I go on my own, maybe I should return to Luralin ah. Village. But if you'd be lonely without me, then I can stay here, mubs. Huh? Don't be ridiculous. With Luralin Village, with Luralin restored, we villagers need to come together and bring life back to our once bustling little village. Oh. I can take care of the shop here, no problem. You should get back to the shop, to the village shop open pronto. You should get the village shop open pronto. And start saving money, too. Ah. Good call, yeah. I'd have preferred to stay with you a while longer. Oh. Okay, I'll make my way to Luralin Village. Leave the village shop to me. Sleepness, this is for the weekend? Yes. You've been on that much sleep for the last five years? Yeah. Yeah, as thanks they gave me crabs. Wait. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. All right, cool. So that's done. Uh, What else we got? Oh, I guess we could talk to her about the wells. We've, we've seen not all of them, but we have been to quite a few since the last time we were there. Ooh. Didn't even know this one was here. Hello. Though rare, fairy sightings are possible inside wells. They're floaty and tough to catch, but you can manage pretty well if you approach them nice and sneaky. Thank you, Royal. Uh, you really want to make some tikka masala? Mm -hmm. uh, do you, yes, I got a few more for you. Ma! Thanks, so 15 of them this time. I'll give you 10 rupees for a location. That's 150 rupees total. All yours! <laughs> Thanks for sharing. I'm excited to go visit all these wells. Let's see, how many are left? 35. Can't be too hard to find old hidden wells. If only there was some sort of tool for searching for things. Let's chat again if you find more well locations. I do happen to have something for searching for things. Now that you mention it. But what's in here? Uh, 
Uh, oh. Interesting. I guess this is a spot for me to to ascend. Hmm. Oh god, that looked horrifying. The little dude. That looked terrifying. Okay. So that's done for now. We need to get 35 more. Picture for dueling peaks. Teach me a lesson. Oh, elaborate picture. Did I take a picture of it? I did. Okay, we can go back and do that. Gloomborn illness. I'm not sure where the energy is starting to. Oh. Hmm. Honey hasn't worked out ideal size yet. Bigger is better, baby. All right, let's pop over to Hateno Village for a hot minute then. I'm just trying to, like, knock out a couple of quests real fast. Also, I think that one needs to be edited so that the capitalization is correct, but otherwise, it's a good quote. Otherwise, that's a pretty good quote. I do like getting, like, quests done, even if there's not a lot to do with them. Like, we just need to go hand them in. That's pretty decent. <sighs> like, it just gets them out of our face. We don't have to wear Ow! Uh. I hate it here. I mean, sometimes. It was typed. Oh. I see. If I just said throw something at my face, why would I ever say that? Is this the right way? Is this the right spot? No. No, it isn't. If they didn't want to be desecrated, they should have been corpses. <laughs> That's a good one. I got something to go in your face. I like that quote. If they didn't want to be desecrated, they shouldn't have been corpses. <laughs> Golden apple. <laughs> like, what a stupid quote. I love it. I found a picture. So, uh, for this class, we'll be going over the climate again. Let's start reviewing our last lesson. Mr. Simmon, can you prove any of this? Isn't it more likely that over time, history and legend started to blur together? Hmm. We're just talking about stuff that happened 10,000 years ago? Ah. Can you point to any paintings or images that actually show there was a calamity 10,000 years ago? Ah. I can see that I'll have to actually show the class the screen depicting the calamity to move forward with my lesson plan. Here you go. We love when something hits our face, or is that just me? What's this? A screen depicting calamity? C class, please take note here. Severe opportunity to see primary source regarding the calamity. <gasps> wow, this looks like the real thing. <laughs> wow. So the legend was true. That's amazing. Huh? Depends on how fleshy and thick. Oh my god. You know, seeing this makes it feel like it might have happened yesterday. <laughs> well, if you got documented proof, that's enough for. It's good enough for me. Go on, Mr. Simon. Tell us the rest of the story about the calamity. <gasps> ah, of course. Thank you so much, Link. My lecture about the Calamity might run long, but I hope you'll stay for it anyway. All right. Okay. The Calamity has visited this land of Hyrule several times over. Sorry, I was taking a drink. However, 10,000 years ago, there were divine beasts built by the Sheikah using their advanced technology. Each of them was controlled by a skilled pilot as well. With the sword that seals the darkness and the power of the sacred princess, the ancient heroes stopped the Calamity. For a long while after that, the lands of Hyrule knew peace. But the time when the people forgot about the Calamity was the moment it returned to menace them once more. Tell us more! When did all this happen? This happened about a hundred years ago. It began with an oracle prophesizing 
the Calamity's return, the royal family took the cues from the legends of the past. They found and excavated the Divine Beasts. Skilled members of the Rito, Goron, Zora, and Gerudo peoples were selected to pirate them. They were called the Champions. Why does Bro look like an old male version of Pura? He's Pura's old sidekick. When Pura was in charge of the Hatena Research Lab, he was her assistant. They're both Sheikahs. With the wielder of the sword that seals the darkness and the sacred princess, all the pieces from the legend were in place. But this time, the claim would not be bested so easily. D did something happen? Outage until like 6 a.m.? Oof. Forgot you had this emote? Oh no. Sadly, the sacred princess was unable to awaken the holy power within her. The divine beasts were taken over by the calamity. Those selected to pirate them lost their lives in the process. Worse still, the hero wielding the sword that seals the darkness was badly hurt. Just when all seemed lost, the sacred princess came into her power and devoted her whole being to keeping the calamity at bay for 100 years. Ah. Is everyone following along so far? <laughs> nice. After spending 100 years dormant, the hero wielding the sword that seals the darkness awakened. His wounds healed. Oh. He won back the Divine Beast with some helpful, help of several allies, including some of the champion's descendants. And in the end, the hero defeated the Calamity, and the Sacred Princess stopped the evil one. Sorry, I got a little emotion there at the end. It's a true story, though. All that we have, our land, our lives, our civilization, we owe it to those who fought the fort through the centuries. Wow, I want to be like the ancient hero and give the next generation good lives, too. <laughs> ah, that went splendidly. He fucking died. Ugh. Words cannot convey my satisfaction. How about you push me and then just touch me till... Anyway. And I couldn't have done it without you showing us the screen link. Once again, thank you so much for your assistance. Yeah. The agent here in the corner. Oh, that's right. You should have done something for your, all your health. Would you, this do? Hell yeah. Nice. <laughs> With his new vegetables being developed, they're harvesting less rice these days. That's a shame, as it's a favorite of mine. You should taste it for yourself, Link. Speaking of rice, our next subject is home economics. I'm planning to use the occasion to talk up dishes that use Halean rice. <laughs> My satisfaction. Can you post a link to in the Discord? I mean, I sip guess. Sip slash sip slash sip slash sip slash sip slash <laughs> sip. Yes. Yummy battery acid net you sip net you sip net you sip net you sip net you sip. You motherfucker. Motherfucker. That's pretty good. Okay. Um Picture of the wetlands, shape of the strongest in the world, Lionel Horn, stable pictures, meat for meat. Uh Wait, what was that one I was just looking at a minute ago, out of the end? Yeah, because that's really close, isn't it? Oh, did I not finish this? Hmm. Please stop drinking battery acid. You're gonna you're gonna burn your throat and tongue and mouth and teeth and lips. Battery acid is not for drinking, you little shits. No. Fuck you. <laughs> the steed takes the lead. God, this fucking rain. Okay, so let's see. Die was asked to watch over an inn, and he's starting to worry that the owner's not coming back. He asked you to try and find him. It seems the owner has gone out to change the survey team's bed sheets. Their tents are located in four different areas, though. So Die's not sure where he could be. Okay. Push me and then just touch me till I can get my satisfaction, 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 satisfaction. Push me and then just touch me till I can get my satisfaction, satisfaction. Drink some Agua Regia instead? Hmm. But what if I didn't want to? But what if I didn't want to? Don't. Okay. Hi there. You don't see many travelers, yada yada yada. Okay. 
Stone slabs. Stone oh. slabs? Five of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Fire, water, lightning, uh -huh. time, and light. That was it. The people say those powers could be used amplified with secret stones to perform great deeds. I hate that yeah. it's secret stones. I don't know what it is. No. Is it? It better not be piss. Aqua Regia was a combination of nitric and sulfuric acid. Okay, well, it's not piss. <laughs> Translated tech post in the other slab. Right, writing is ancient, so it couldn't be going to tell you how to read it. That's okay. How do you do? I see you've met my faithful handyman. He's just a little brought down because when you knocked, he thought you were the candyman. Really, guys? Glad you're all enjoying my suffering with this TTS nonsense. I've made a mistake. Mistakes were made. It dissolves just about anything organic. Like my will to live. <laughs> this guy. Ugh, okay. Okay, I suddenly don't give a shit about this quest. <laughs> um, You know what we could do? Oh wait, there was a, a well that we didn't go into, wasn't there? Yeah, we were gonna go do this well. Let's go do that real fast. We love you, honey. Thank you. Aqua Vitae, which is pure ethanol before you looked it up. Oh god. In seconds? Just like my will to live. Just like my will to live. All right, let's go check out this well real fast. Posted a link in the memes this row. Okay. I will check it later. I wonder if I could take a picture of Koroks. Okay, so we need to go this way. Bop, bop. Bop, bop. Remember the Koroks to sp I I do not send the Koroks to space. I'm very kind to the Koroks. They're little- they're just kids. They're just kids. They're just- they're just babies. I, shut up with beans. Fuck you. Regia is just in for dissolving gold and platinum. Why would you want to dissolve gold and platinum? That seems like a waste of gold and or platinum. Alright, so we found another well. Oh god, oh god, I made a mistake! I made a mistake! <gasps> to purify them? Oh. Okay. That makes more sense. Fun you should ask that. Hey, Ruby. To drink it. Stop drinking battery acid, you little shits. Is that just a rock? This is just a rock. This might just be a rock. Oh, it's just a rock. <gasps> oh, it knocked over the mushrooms! Whoops. I wish I could dive. Oh, yeah. I guess this is everything that's in here. You still haven't found the helmet to that set, but you're gonna... How are you? To this set? You mean you haven't found this helmet? The soldier's helm? Is that what you mean? It give you energy? Don't drink it. Space gives all the oxygen they need for photosynthesis, right? Mate, I don't know. I missed... Oh, oh god, you guys are talking too fast. Hi, Mama Muta. 
Makes sense. Deciding ideal price. Full of not a single swear. Oh, God. Deciding it. Uh-huh. Uh, when a certain party came to power in Germany, in order to protect the gold Nobel Prize is awarded to two scientists, another scientist dissolved them in, in, in the aqua regia and hid them in a jar with other chemicals. The party assumed, eh, chemicals and ignored it. Afterward, the gold was precipitated out and returned to the Nobel Committee, and the medals are recast and reawarded. I feel like that by itself is enough for a, um... A Nobel Prize. Uh, Wraith, do you want a clue on, on where to find the helm for it? It's not a very good clue, but it is a clue. Uh, the clue is uh, they're all in the same area. So if you, where you found the legs and the helmet, you will find them there. You will, or the legs in the chest, you'll find the helmet there too. In that same general zone. Hmm. So much game to play, you don't mind tiny hands? Yeah. Because cause I found all of them at about the same time. The area was disorienting. It really is. It absolutely is. I love that you can just pick the little dudes up. I love that you can just pick them up. Now you know it'll be worth it, yeah. Yeah, because when I when I did it, I got all of them like at the same time. We go and just eat those guys. You love it, yeah. Scrumbo time. Hey, mythics. Just go. Yeah. You don't wash off the acid immediately. It can cause third degree burns in under a minute. Ow. I would prefer not to get third degree burns. Thanks. Given the option. That's anything with high morale. Molarity? Molars? What about molars? Oh, that's not a stone talus. Alright, there's a little little bit too much going on right now. Thought you were stuck. Nope. A hemorrhoid with teeth? Okay. Having all of these threats all at once is bullshit. Chemistry measurement of how much something is dissolved. The measure is the unit is moles derived from molecules. Oh, got it. Having having several different types of enemies like that is a little bit bullshit. That's the most horrifying description of a lake like you've heard yet. Mm hmm. 
It's definitely up there. Oh, you know what? I forgot to take off the, um... I forgot to take off the ball. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Who's, who's ass mode is that first one? Neftanica. I don't know that person. Yes, I had to, to figure that out mid-fight. Ow! Uh, I'm amazed that some of those emotes haven't been, like, purposefully removed. I hate it when they're on the ass of the thing like this. Alright, buddy. I was really scared. I thought that had hit me. Sorry, Chad. I gotta focus for a second. I gotta focus. Uh, let's eat something that's gonna give me... Let's get the defense up, I guess. Mostly VR chat. Did you share my... Ah, okay. Trying to focus. Let me help with that step one. God damn. Alright, easy. Easy. Chat. GG easy. You're tired, but you can't sleep. Oh, I'm sorry, Buck Tire. I'm sorry, hun. I'm trying to forget. The self destruct. <laughs> Perfect timing. I hate how, how difficult it is to, like, just rotate yourself when you're doing that. <laughs> sleep insomnia is a hell of a thing. Yeah. I'm sorry that you're having trouble getting some sleep. Get rotated? Listen. Listen. No! Kind of rude video game, but I know how to deal with your bullshit now. I know how to deal with your bullshit. But yeah, I'm sorry that you're experiencing some uh, less than pleasant feelings with uh, sleep. Yeah, I I'm used to dealing with things that are too wet, though. You just need to get some wood.
And you can deal with them that way. Just a smidgen of wood to deal with your problems. No! My wood is not enough. Wait, don't I have like a sticky elixir or something? No. Damn. I thought I might have a sticky elixir. But I do have the climbing shirt. Get wrecked, video game. Fuck you. Fuck you. Susub sign. Get fucked. <laughs> You're not all. All right, easy. How many links to replace the label? Yeah, the sub sub shrine. The su sub shrine. The shrine for sus subs. AKA chat. A bunch of sus subs. Okay, not bad, not bad. How many links does it take to replace a light bulb or kink? How many? Oh, is this just an easy one? Oh, it's just a reward one. I guess the sub knows to just reward me. Can either confirm or deny the truth. Okay, so you're a sub. Got it. Uh, I guess I can drop that. Cool, free shrine. Yeah. <laughs> the sub shrine has a magic stick. You mean you don't know? Fair. Uh... I do put my stick in the sub shrine. <laughs> we have fun here, chat. We have fun here. Or at least we try. We haven't got that far with anyone yet. Ah, don't worry, you'll get there. We all do eventually, maybe. Usually. All right, is there anything else interesting down here? I mean, there's a like like. Alright, little fucker. Jerk. You're almost a wizard. Well, dating is hard, I'm not gonna lie. Gotten jizzballed and pulled out of my- Yeah, exactly. I was going for the ball, but... Oh, an eightfold blade. Alright, um... I need more carry capacity. Oh, I can drop one of the torches. I don't need two torches. You can't recursively quote me. Oops. I mean, let's be honest. Dating is legit kind of hard these days with social media and, and dating apps and shit. Dating is not the easy game that it used to be where you just showed up to a pretty girl with an apple. Thank you for the follow of the genie system. Welcome in. You want to date someone in a different department at work, but you're not. You're moving to Australia. Back to Australia next May? I see. I could see why that could uh, cause potential frustrations in terms of dating. But thank you for the follow. I'm pretty well today. I've been single for a long time. Hmm. <laughs> 
That's kind of funny. That's kind of funny, chat. Yeah. Alright, the Day of Village Ruins. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I wonder what's up there. Listen! Yes. Gore novel, the act of hitting somebody with a fish. Why would you hit somebody with a fish? I mean, I guess in the, for fun. Oh, this just takes me right back to where I was. <laughs> because it's funny? You know what? That's fair. To quote Tobey Maguire, I had to beat a lady with a fish to get this. Okay. Yeah. Or was it a stick? Excellent question, I don't know. Let's see where this takes me. Slap doop it with a huge trout. Stop that. You know what? That's pretty funny. <laughs> the peen rocket. Oh, uh, it was a chode <laughs> going into your ass at mock speed. I don't know why that was funny to me, but it was. Oh, right, because I have a juvenile sense of humor. Hmm. French has a word for slapping someone in the face with a penis. Biffle. Interesting. If she ever matures, I'll be out of a job. Yeah, I gave it one climactic send-off. I did. Ah, oh, dragon! A dragon! Farosh! Hi, Farosh! Wait, have I been down here? Oh, I haven't been down here. Oh, wait, is that a... Is that a Yiga place? Hold on. Oh, God, they've just got a bunch of spinny lasers. Okay, cool. That was easy. Welcome to the ah, come what? Zone. Hi. What? Hello. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. I will welcome to the come zone. Hello. Are you going to play the Alien PTB next week? I will most likely wait until it's on the live servers. I don't generally deal with going to the PTB because I'm extremely lazy. I'm very lazy. But I am excited. Veron, shh, give me your shit. Darude stands. We received reports of sounds coming from inside the large wall to the southwest. 
Specifically, they're coming from the striped wall that extends up to the ceiling. We have searched the depths for some point of entry, or some sort of entry point, but to no avail. Were the sounds figment of our imagination? Or could it be there's an entrance somewhere else? If only we had a map of this place, we could know for sure. Thank you for the... Oh, thank you for the bits! Lordy Master Koga. Thank you, Sally. Or I guess I should call you ass? Question mark. Well, thank you regardless for the bits. Alright, what do we got in here? Only if you slap their Sally first. Yay, large kill slash charge. Okay. And... A Yiga Schematic! The Beam Spinner. Interesting. Those are the dealies that are, that are up there spinning away. Okay. Well, this is absolutely not the place that I intended to go. Um, Alright, you know what I should do? You know what I should do? I should do this Gloomborn Illness one. Porridge. Uh, what, por what porridge was it? Let's see. I have the recipe list. Hmm. Maybe we should go back and double check. Okay. It was me, Jinwo Marira, <laughs> all along. It was. The beam goes speed and wow. Yes, it does. Time for some sleep sponsored by Henneta's voice. Have fun and good night, everyone. Thank you, Manny, for being here. What if the beam had the sound of Hanedu saying, Get wrecked, nerd, whenever it passes by. Get wrecked, nerd. Get wrecked, nerd. Get wrecked, nerd. Model kinds of look like a goth girl linked to me if it comes across as rude. It makes sense. You know, get love, nerds. I'm not going to get, I'm not going to say that's bad because when I was a young lad, um, when I was but a young boy, uh, Link was, like, who I wanted to be when I grew up. Yeah, my father took me into the city. No, my father's a douchebag. Uh, but no, I, um... <sighs> Fuck, when, when Orcarina of Time came out, Link was, like, my hero. He fucked off and you listened to some other band. I don't have anything against My Chemical Romance. If that's what you're suggesting. Alright, which which building was this in? Over here? Oh right, she was she was underneath the thingy. Galan et Vedr Vedrids. <laughs> Young Hanetta wrote Link in job I'd like to work at when I grow up. I did. Oh, it's you again. Did you come back to worry about my grandmother? I knew this would happen. I never thought about a research team. She's the most important. Gloom. Porridge. Gloom, sickness, but none have worked. Porridge that will help grandmother and soon. Gloom. Yeah, yeah, okay. East Hill Chasm. Gloom. Okay, I got that. What about porridge? Halean rice, fresh milk, wild greens. Halean rice, fresh milk, wild greens. Halean rice. Halean rice, fresh milk, wild greens. Halean rice. Hold. Fresh milk, wild greens, sundial. Okay, goals, Link. For some reason, you love KDA. Link in Ocarina of Time as a kid is beefy, like beefy. Farm sunny veggie porridge. Farm gives you farming gives you ribbage, yeah. Rice milk greens. It's getting worse and worse. Make her porridge. I have some porridge. Will this work? Huh? What is that gentle aroma? Is that the porridge I smell? Could it be? Did you make the porridge that helps with the glimpse sick Give it a try. 
What did you say this was again? A sunny veggie porridge? Never made anything sunny before. Maybe this will help my grandmother. Her mouth? <laughs> yeah, her mouth was terrifying. Mm -hmm. Well, grandmother, how is it? Ah. Thank you, Lasley. That was the first meal I've been able to finish in quite a while. Ah. Grandmother, your complexion. The color's coming back to your cheeks. Huh. Ah. Hey, look, are you seeing this? A few bites of your sunny veggie porridge, and it's like she was never even sick. Oh. So you were the one that made that porridge for me. Such a gentle flavor. It didn't just nourish my body, but my spirit, too. Thanks to you and your gra and my granddaughter, it seems I'll be around for a long time yet. I'm so grateful to have to the both of you. Ah. Grandmother, what are you doing up? Ah. Oh, Clary, I'm sorry I worried you. But this nice young man made me a wonderful sunny veggie porridge, so I'm feeling much better now. Oh. Hold on. You're doing this much better after one bowl of porridge? I guess I knew that Lasley's plan, but I'm still amazed it actually worked. Ah. Now that I'm feeling better, you should hurry and prepare for your journey, Lasley. Oh. Huh? You knew? <laughs> she can't get anything by her, Lasley. Besides, everyone knows studying fashion in Hatena Village is your dream. Grandmother and I can take care of Enchanted by ourselves. Trust me. You deserve this. Oh. What are you, a kappa? You brought me something sucks the soul out of your butt. Oh god, are you a kappa? Are you sure you don't want to go study with her? Oh. Well, I'd be lying if I said I didn't, but there's something else I want more. I want to make a chance at a success, right here in my beloved Kakariko village, right next to my beloved grandmother, and ah. I dream of someday filling our wall to, our store wall to wall with your with outfits you designed, Lasley. You're a hologram, I see. With that mouth, she gets the soul out of you from any orifice. Okay. You make for weirdly inspirational ambience while writing up D&D &D stuff. Nice. Don't worry about me. Go study hard in Hateno Village and come back to us a fashion icon. <laughs> you mean it? Thank you, Clary. That mouth, though. And thank you, Grandmother. <sighs> well, now that Grandmother's all better, I guess it's time to head back to the shop. Gotta make sure our prices are back to normal and everything's ready for our customers. You should come by and chant it yourself. With that mouth, she probably does weird things to people who sleep in the village. She probably <laughs> sucks your nose while you sleep. Slurp, slurp, slurp. I hate that. Thank you so much for your help. I made a lot of porridge trying to find a cure for my Grandmother. We won't be able to eat it all ourselves. I think it turned out pretty tasty, though. So I'd love to give you some to take on your journey. Ooh, energizing porridge. Gonna work hard for my big sister. Just watch. I'll be a fashion designer who changes the world. Gloomborn illness completed. Ah. That porridge. That was sunny veggie porridge, wasn't it? Never tasted anything quite like that. It was as if poison were drawn from my body. And such a comforting flavor, too. Oh. Oh. I feel like I have a whole new lifetime ahead of me. I mean, you'll probably live to be several hundred years old. Ah. Thanks to you, I'm gonna actually going to get to study fashion in Hateno Village with a clear conscience, but Hateno Village is far to the east Me on the edge sucky of the- sucky now, mommy. Mom's milk. Okay. <laughs> when you go to the inn and you use it, the game is like, your sinuses are clearer now, but your face feels oddly moist. I hate that I read that. <laughs> Next killer, Leslie. Yes. You didn't need to- <laughs> no one asked you to do that. You did it anyway. Well played. <laughs> Uh, so I won't be able to visit Kakariko often. I'm actually a bit nervous going on on my own, but I'd be happy if you came to visit me sometime. Sure. Alright, so our prices should be back to normal. She could survive at least 100 years. Exactly. More so if you like if you hack like Pura, right? Yeah. Welcome to Chanted, the high-end boutique. Oh, it's you. Another grandma's back to normal. I go back to our normal ah. prices. The fashion world owes you a debt. Now where was I? Ah, yes. We also buy anything you don't need. So just talk to me when you're ready. Ah. Reminds me, for a limited time, customers who buy a piece of clothing from us receive a special gift. So get shopping. All right, chat. What should we get first? What should we get first, chat? Femboy sneaky outfit? Or radiant outfit? Or skeleboy outfit? A cock piece? You had somebody ask you if you were gay over DM recently. You responded with, do you like triangles? And they were like, oh, you're that kind of hologram. A cock. Alright. Ninja stuff. Unleash your options. We can either get... We can get... Okay, so 700, 500, 600... 800, 
eight hundred. Okay, fuck that. We're getting we're getting the mask. We're getting the cheap mask. Actually, wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Cause I already have several stealth masks. I have I have this stealth mask already, and I have the stealth bodysuit, and I have the stealth legs. Okay, hold on. <laughs> that looks so silly. <laughs> Unleash the inner femboy, I'll femboy. We love the femboy. <laughs> oh man, that looks that looks fucking weird. All right, we'll get the we'll get that one. Stealth tights, oddly enough, backstab is done to you is highly effective. Linkle, especially spears. Just talking about shafts. Oh. Made a great purchase, really, when you buy a piece of clothing, we're offering a special gift. So here you go, you fashion maven, you. Oh, Sheikah fabric. Cool. Paraglider fabric. Oh. I actually like that. Thank you for your patronage. Hell yeah. I like, like, Leek looks so unnecessarily buff in this outfit. It just doesn't fit him. Did she just call you a fashion slut? She called me a fashion maven. Yes. Go, ninja. Go, ninja. Go, ninja. Go. <laughs> okay, so we've done that quest. We still need to do the white bird one. We have a bunch of these that we need to do. Hmm. <laughs> 10 sunset fireflies still. Zelda's golden horse, potential princess sightings, Team CCRT's read. Hmm. We received a message. Oh yeah, we need to go back to Koyan later. Let's do that. All right, I think chat. I think the best thing that we should do is go here. Why did you pause? You said Maven, bitch. I want to know. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I like that it's been like an hour and we've accomplished basically nothing. <laughs> Actually, that's not true. We've actually got quite a bit, quite a bit done, all things considered. We've completed a lot of quests. So next up is that. That's our next plan. Is that fucker? You just try and cleared some quests that sounds like progress. True. You forgot to save your game after the gym battle this morning. You have to redo everything. Ah, shit. I'm sorry, Shadow Riker. Where are you? Lord, what are you doing? Also, hi, Cat Lord. <laughs> what if there was a random trans cyber small? There was some guy waiting for you to warp, and then I've nowhere this fucking asshole. Trout kicks you off the tallest spire? I mean, that would be kind of funny.
Like, I would be baffled by it, but it'd be kind of funny. Whoa? What are we woeing? Am whom? Welcome home. Welcome home. My ads are amazing. Oh, I don't know what the ads are. I don't, I don't get to choose what they are. They just do their own thing, and I just pray that they're not terrible. Okay. Literally, wet sounds are twenty nine twenty nine dollars. What? That's. That sounds terrifying to me. That sounds mildly terrifying to me. Oh shit, my balance! My balance, chat! Yeehaw! Indeed. Chat, my balance is fucked. Temperature is getting very high. Well, yeah, because there's a flame gliok near me. Which is not what I signed up for. Can make your own wet sounds for free, Pants Grab. I'm very proud of you. I'm very proud of you, Jeff Man. Alright, I'm not quite sure what happened there, but... A new flying discount TIE Fighter? Yeah. Ugh, it looks all groove. Boop, boop. My gills! Uh. You, you there! Please help me. The sludge fell upon me so suddenly. If I could wash it away, if only I had some water. Okay, hold on. There you go. You, you saved me. Thank you. How shameful that this should happen to me, Captain of the Guard at Zora's Domain. Unbelievable. Uh. Kiss him to life. The 777 thing earlier, the number was at Trigantillion, which is 793. Good God. Kiss him to life is intact. After the upheaval, that filth suddenly started falling from the sky. It sullied the waters around here and in Zora's domain. Everyone is at their wit's end because of it. Oh, one sec. I gotta stand up. That is why I set myself to investigate the surrounding area myself. Oh, that's why I set out to investigate the surrounding area myself. To think I would fall prey to falling sludge myself. Er <sighs> Ugh, just thinking of it makes my scales bristle. Ugh, my gills still feel so unclean. If you had not sprayed me with that water, I shudder to think what would have happened to me. Please take a Zora spear as a token of my thanks. I'm sorry it is not much, but it's all I have. It's decayed like all the other weapons at the time of the upheaval. Well, but, well, it's not unusable, at least. Huh? Hmm? Ah, you have many weapons in your possession, it would seem. If you make a room in turn, I'll give you the Zora spear. Okay. <laughs> Getting fish daddy now? Yeah. My motto is frozen. It's because I stood up. I was stretching my legs. 10 followed by 93 zeros. Jesus Christ. Take this Zora spear pants grab, right? Yeah, no, it's because I had stood up. Do, 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 twink. 10 to the 93rd power. Horrifying. Four eggs? They're four eggshis. I hate myself. I'm gonna take a drink while this cutscene plays, because I like these cutscenes. So Burr Village got frozen, Goron's got had crack rock, Zoro's getting fucked on. Yes. Yep, the Zoro's got mucked on. Why do I have a feeling that's gonna be where our thing is? I want you to know, chat. Did I make a pun? I don't think I made a pun. I want you to know that, like, this game 
watching this this particular cutscene when we get the map and just like seeing the scale of the game gives me like that same childlike wonder you know i want you to know that it's dangerous to go alone take this emote that looks like someone is holding up some panties okay thank you i will Aha! Uh -huh. Oh! F <laughs> I missed the name of the shrine, but I'll get it back in a minute. All right, time to see what this baby has in it. You love that fan? Everyone gets hit with it. <laughs> Makes my brain happy. It does. It just gives me that sense of wonder. Wings. Oh. Beam emitters. Okay. Cool. That that fan was pretty good. Who knew the Death Star was so small when you take one step and fall off, right? Okay. Yeah, no, but that was that was absolutely really funny. Big big fun. Big funny. There's a chest out there. Okay, so what was the name of the shrine? I missed the name of the shrine. I almost started doing the Indiana Jones theme. All right, hold on. What was the name of the shrine? And then I'll reach out. A flying device, a Jiro Tagu Mac shrine. Next time you change name on your alt account, it's going to go back to Flog Me Daddy, and then the other is going to be something about Boy Smell Delicious. Boy Moi. Moi. All right, let's see. You know what? I'm gonna be lazy. I'm gonna be lazy. I could have done that with like some fancy fadiddling, but I'm just gonna be lazy. I went to the made pictures, my phone background. I I don't know how to feel about that. Like like, it's very cool, but also mildly terrifying. If that makes any sense. Yandre. I can be Yandre. It's not like I like you or anything. I'm just gonna cut you. I'm more of a Sundre.
I'm not very good at being Yendere because you don't have the strongly obsessive feeling, so I like being bullied. Shut up. Not really. I'd rather do the bullying. Not one of the other hentai honey tie ones. True. True. <laughs> Feels kind of bad because like there's that whole section that doesn't really do anything. You've only been here two hours, you know, I said that you're a Sundere? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I guess I could have done it from that pillar, but... Look, it's not my fault that I have a maid outfit. It's only me who commissioned the picture, okay? And Sane did a great job on it. I think it's a very good picture. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> I... Don't bully me. No surprises from behind. More jizz balls. Okay. That's pretty good. We got two whole jizz balls. Alright. Two whole jizz balls from the furry queen. I mean furry queen. I mean furry queen. Anyway, I got off on a tangent at some point, but yeah, Link was like my hero when I was a little kid. When I was but a young Hanedu. Wait. Ha! I did it! I did it! I got underneath! Ooh. She's not a furry, she just has an exception. I see. I'm gonna get hit by the stupid thing again, aren't I? <laughs> oh, beautiful, amazing. <laughs> That was perfect in every way. Royal, did you enjoy that? Did you enjoy that? I hope you enjoyed that. All right, um. Who could have known this rake was here? Splattered in face with rake. <laughs> All right. Uh, this this might not work. This might be a bust, Chad. This might be a bust. I don't think Link can climb perfectly horizontal surfaces upside down. Yeah. Okay, uh, in that case... Well, I guess we can just boing ourselves back up. Thank you for clipping it. Yeah, that, that picture was done by Sane. Uh, she put in, a, like, an open call for commissions a while back, and I just, I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna give it a shot. And apparently she really loves drawing maid outfits, so she took the commission. She just never tweeted it, because apparently she doesn't tweet out, um, commissions most of the time. Lazy Link can't defy gravity. Speaking of tits, wait, no, no, that kind. Stop looking down your shirt! But yeah, she's the one who drew that for me. 
this was a commercial. The Lanayru Sky Archipelago. Wonder if the climber's claws let you climb upside down. I think those were a thing in the other game. I don't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Splash boot. Think Sane was one of the first artists you follow way back and realized people could draw cool things on the internet. Yeah, no, I really like her art, and I'm super glad that I got a picture from her. Uh, specifically of the maid Hanedu. I feel it's really good. I think if I ever got a maid outfit from Tivi as part of the model, it would be a little bit more revealing, though. Thank you for lurking, Linen. Oh, we see that. Sleepy Chakat. Sleepy Chakat. Thank you for lurking. An old map! You already found the treasure shown on this old map. Tibby doesn't do panties. <laughs> well, apparently not. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so I kind of want to do this the quote-unquote legit... Actually... The line was the bottom. We already knew that. There's like her revealing outfits. Yeah. Look, if I'm going to be a maid, I'm going to be a sexy French maid, okay? But, you know, safe for Twitch. Oh, I don't like that at all. Okay. That was pretty cool. <laughs> Thank you, Royal. Oh, whoops. That was that was pretty cool, actually. Um, where did it deposit me? The Rallis Channel. Interesting. Interesting. Follow the beam to its end and offer the crystal there. Do so, and I will offer you a light that banishes evil. Nice. Okay. Cool. Uh, before we do that, though... See what's over here. Oh, just another entrance. Okay. Unfortunately, present me is a lazy bitch. Look, it's true. Okay, big question. If I stick this on here, will that be enough to sink it? Doesn't seem particularly buoyant. I guess if I do it this way, I don't really need the, uh... 
I don't really need that. How's that a quote from the future? Magic. I mean, we're kind of underwater, but it's working. My greed is getting the better of me. Hi. Actually, that was kind of worth it. Five arrows? Get off my ship! Witch! Lurk, joining the sleepy cuddle puddle. Alright, thank you, Jeffman, for being here. Please, please imagine the chat cats as a giant puddle of cats together. You know, like when you see cats all curled up in a ball? That. That's what the chat cats are like. that. Not too bad, that one. Okay. Let's get that. The chat cats become the eldritch hoarder pile of cats? Yes. Indeed. Alright, what shrine was this? I didn't see the name of it. I did not see the name of this shrine. This will be our 67th shrine. All right, the Jonyu Shrine. Jonyu, another Raoru's blessing. We do like getting blessed by the furry king. Question, whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, large zone I charge. All right, cool. You can tell I kind of lost the plot on that one. <laughs> mm, excuse me. Okay. Get a free jizz ball. Got something you can bless right your pants grab. I just imagine Queen Sonya looking at this race of, like, goat men and just sitting back and going, Wood. <laughs> Wood. Like, ma'am. Mother, why am I cat? Lamau. 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 I hate it here. Lamau. 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 I've made mistakes. Lamau. Lamau. I've made I've made horrible mistakes. I like how the fish are like trying desperately to swim against the current. Nice stuff in here. Alright, do I have a rock? I do have the sledge still. We spin, we do spin. Thank you for the follow, Gold Osberg. You got extremely bored and you were looking through the Hyrule map and you noticed that the bottom of Grunetown looks like a child drew a cat. I don't think I don't think I have it yet. I haven't been down there yet. Now I'm gonna wait and have to see that, and it's all I'm gonna be able to see later. Curse these eyeballs! I'll have to wait until I get there and check that out. But thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good day today. Hmm. Ah, 
I was gonna say, you know what we haven't seen here? This fucker. It's funny to look at map. See small little Easter eggs? I believe it. Oh, bright-eyed crab. This crab appears in large numbers when it rains. One bite of its delectable meat, and you'll forget all your exhaustion. It replenishes your stamina when cooked into a dish. Crab. Crab. Crab! That was interesting. You exploded. Crap. Sticky leisure. Okay. Uh, okay, so we've done that. Oh, God. Look at it. It's all green and gross. All right. So I kind of want to go... Like, I want to enter this from here and work my way up. So I guess we'll start from here, maybe, and then just kind of go through this and make our way up Zora's domain. And that's going to be the plan that we take to get through the Zora section. I feel like we get the that was interesting you exploded quote a lot, like a surprising amount. Hmm. Why do I have notifications on Discord? Thank you for putting that clip. <laughs> How to punish a cat? Flashbang him. <laughs> Thank you, Roy. Thank you for that, Linen. Uh, that was great. Okay. Uh, oh, another dragon. Nadra's doing Nadra things. All right, let's go this way. And see what we can see with our sea. I don't really have to do anything. Oh, hello. him with his own horn. I love doing this. Easy. You know what they say, spicy jerky is good for a soldier's strength, but a spicy jerk is good for their morale. I stand by that. I like how there was fire fruit out here, like, hey, hint, hint, hint. Oh, wait, did I take pictures of those? Hmm. That was weird. 
That was weird. Took his friend's face and stabbed him with it. God, imagine if you were fighting someone and they picked up your buddy's arm and just beat you to death with it. That would be a little bit fucked up, don't you think? I would find that to be a little bit fucked up. A throwing spear? Interesting. It would be horrifying. Yeah. Alright, what do we got in this chest? Oh, Liza Boomerang. Nice. I'm looking for more wheat and stuff, but... Oh well. We're just finding crickets to murder. I do think this is kind of cool, though. Alright, let's go. Okay. Horses. Horses, chat. There's horses. Murderer? It's fine. It's fine. Oh, that must have be been a hunter over there. Yep. Alright, what do we got in this chest? <gasps> Fifty dollar dues! Man, I love horses. Milk. Milha. Instead of milf, man, I love horses. Alright. Did you know if you put your ear to a wall, you can hear the wailing of the dead? So they say, anyway. I have heard. <laughs> wow, Hero's really doing a little bit of everything. And guess what? You'll be joining those wailing dead very soon! <sighs> Join Master Koga in defeat! <laughs> okay, bye. I mean, that was easy. Okay, uh, is there anything good down here? No, not really. Bomb flower, I guess. Hey, Ronan. How you doing? So I guess there was just a dude down here waiting to try and murder me. How you doing today? How goes your time in Palia? Joining in on the cat puddle cuddle? Yes. It's comfy. It is comfy. Still recovering? No, I'm sorry. I hope you feel better soon. You should totally take tomorrow off work. Enjoy yourself a little bit. I guess that was the bird flying off? I'm gonna alert all the other hunters in the area. Ah, shit! Well, there's some people standing over there. Hold on, let's go talk to them. Enjoy some pants grab if need be. Oh, lord. Oh, lord, chat. God, it feels so nice having, like, full-on stamina. I know you. We met that one time, didn't we? You know, after my interview with Jasha for the Chasm Research position, when I walked away in a miserable failure. Quite a tough interviewer Jasha was. I doubt even the most gifted scientific mind could have held up their scrutiny. Oh. Hmm. 
You may look at me and think, that man is not a doctor, but in fact this is precisely my vocation. And being somewhat not young, I feel an urgency to make a lasting mark on the, the profession before my sunset years. That was why I volunteered for the Zonai survey team. You see, I believe that new elixirs and remedies might be derived from the plants and animal life found in chasms. Huh. chasms. That's why I'm here. This is my chance to be on the ground floor of a new field of chasm medicine. Oh, okay, cool. Good, 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 good for you, buddy. What are those guys doing over there? I just love the way they fucking fly around sometimes. No, he stabbed me in the back! That rude bitch. Ugh, that rude bitch. Stabbed me in the back. How dare he. I cannot believe- you know what, maybe I should put my combat armor back on. Like, I'm still wearing, like, literally just the, the random garbage that I picked up. There we go. Definitely, definitely put my combat armor on. <sighs> and he fucking died. Electric shock, though. <laughs> oh god. The weird motion that he's making looks like he's humping. I hate that. Wi-Fi has returned? Hell yeah. Welcome back. I love to wear garbage. Apparently, yes. Apparently, I do love wearing garbage. As is my right. Steel Lysel shield. Okay, I can get rid of the other Lysel shield that's garbo. Okay, um... I should do an episode cut. We've gone over. Oops. <laughs>